welcome to my channel so in today's video i will be telling you guys why i haven't been posting since a long time on this channel so mainly the reason was that i was working on many projects and one of that on and one of that work was to make my uh, to make my channel and f uh, more uh, filled with more quality content and i because i want qualitative uh, uh, items in my channel because i want you guys to like get benefits from these videos i want you guys to learn from something so another reason for that was that because you all guys all of you know because i posted many shorts on this rc uh, remote control bluetooth controlled arduino based car so there were many competitions held for this car and i participated in it and successfully i managed to win many of them so first i won this so there was a summer camp arranged by bits and bytes and I won that competition. It was an intra-camp competition in which uh, students of many universities, while I was in school, uh, while I was from school level, uh, there, there were students from university level whom I bet, and I won the, that competition. Secondly, I won another shield, uh, which is which was for the same competition, RC car competition held in SAE. Uh, in UT, uh, the University of Engineering and Technology, which is and this was a national competition, which I won uh, again all the university level students and some schools which were competing. So I I appeared as an individual. I wasn't in a team. I was I wasn't part of any team. I appeared individual. So the uh, because I was focusing on these competitions, that this is one major reason why I wasn't able to post. Secondly, I am I was working on making a Raspberry Pi Pico based drone. Yeah, so a drone, because I love to make drones, and especially when it is made, because I love to do make DIY things, do it yourself. So I was having some problems into deciding uh, and to decide whether I should make a small drone or a big drone. So I'm I would really appreciate if you guys comment below and tell me that what type of drone should I make? Should I add a camera or not? And which propeller you can tell like in comment you can comment like which color propeller should I use? The white ones or the black ones and which motor should I use because I'm having a really hard time in deciding which motor should I use. So it will be really appreciated if you guys help me in that. And also, I want you guys to know that I will be posting uh, projects with full detail and source code available on Raspberry Pi Pico, like all of those projects, because this is a very famous microcontroller and is like going on a trending list in the whole industry. So after we are done with making loads of videos and dozens of videos on this microcontroller, we will start with the Arduino family, which is just right here, the Arduino Uno, the Arduino Mega, and many others which I also have told you guys about in the previous videos. And I also even got this official res officially released Raspberry Pi Pico book, which, which uses MicroPython, which is great because MicroPython is relatively very easy to use as compared to the like the general python uh, code another announcement which i want to make is especially for all those lego fans on my channel so guys i will be buying loads of lego sets the original newly released lego sets because i love lego and just like you guys i'm a huge lego fan fan so i have been like saving loads of money to buy all those lego sets which i want and also you can you can wait for some vlogs in the lego shops which i will be going into like i because i really want to keep up with my audience and make quality quality data just like i mentioned before because i love lego i will be buying a lot of lego and you can also be uh, looking forward in getting some vlogs on my channel uh, in lego shops and also the build the build and review videos of lego sets because uh school because our school the the academic year is has successfully ended and i have passed my grade the standard and now because so and because of that we got the clubs which we used to be held and i because i was participating in the lego ev3 club uh, uh i cannot participate in it anymore because the school has ended 
So for that, I will be buying my own Lego Mindstorms kit. And this time, the thing is that I won't be buying the Lego EV3 because that is now old, guys. I will be now. Now I will buy the Mindstorms Robot Inventor fi uh, 51515. This is the code of that item. I will be buying that, and we will make videos and we will make projects on that specific new Lego Mindstorms kit. It is great. I checked out some review videos. I will be posting, and you can even see some of the pictures which I am posting right on in this video. Because Lego Mindstorms has always been a successful way to learn in the STEM field and get yourself involved with coding and programming. So this is uh, this was an uh, announcement which I wanted to make, and soon you can expect. You can e you can easily expect me to be posting more and more regular videos, and I will make sure that I post at least two videos, two long videos, on yeah, every week. Like I will make two videos, two long videos to upload every week, and some shorts side by side. So make sure that you like, share, and subscribe. And if you're a Lego fan, that you definitely need to turn on the bell notification so that you can get notified when I, whenever I start with the Lego Lego series, the Lego vlogs and the Lego build stuff. So make sure you like, share, subscribe and comment and help me in deciding that which thing should I be using. And if you know some more links or some websites which could help possibly help me, then make sure that you do that too because that would be really great. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And you and and I, and I will make sure that I you that I post a lot of quality content on this channel. Like, share, and subscribe. Bye, guys.